All right, this weekend, the far left came together to demand Trump's impeachment. It was not well attended anywhere. We did send our friend and our colleague and investigative reporter, our guy that hits the streets hard, Lawrence Jones, to one of the rallies, this one in New York City, to ask, okay, why should the president be impeached? Let's watch. I'm here because I believe in democracy. And you believe the president should be impeached? I do. Why? Because he's an illegal president. He's an illegal president. Explain that for me. He was in he was in cahoots with the Russians. Why do you believe the president should be impeached? Because um, he's obstructed justice. I mean, he's committed really impeachable offenses. If there were any other president, uh, any Democratic president, any other even Republican president, he would have been impeached and thrown out of office. Do you believe the president should be impeached? No. Uh, there's been investigation after investigation. They found nothing. He's been investigated more than any other president. What crimes has he committed? He was, he was with everything with uh, uh, with Russia. Like, it, like he conned his way into the office. We've been putting up with an illegal, fake, illegally elected president for over two years. What crime do you suspect the president has committed? Well, number one, conspiracy with the Russians, and then he covered it up like, like you can't believe it. He's, he's a criminal for a long time. Why don't you think the Democrats have brought up the articles of impeachment? That's a good question. Uh, I wish I could read Pelosi's mind, but I can't. Do you believe he's putting the country in real danger? Yes, every day, How? every single day. He loves our country. He's a good man. They want communism here. Well, then go to Venezuela, and I'm very angry. There were some moments, vile, racist, vicious, horrible. Two men actually approached our own Lawrence Jones, and one told him to go back to Fox News where there's, quote, more cotton for you to pick. Uh, we don't have that on tape, but we do have the next comment on tape. Take a look. And the obvious way to people before us that, that a cop is all this. Let's go back to Kenya next. Okay. Here now is Fox News contributor, editor in chief, campus reform, Lawrence Jones. Um, we talked Saturday. I was pretty pissed off. Yeah. You probably heard. Uh, me in a way I don't usually go on the air, true or false, but um, I'm upset that that true. happened. Um, tell us, tell us, tell everybody what happened. I thought these were supposed to be the the accepting, loving, wonderful, tolerant people of the left. Apparently not. Yeah, this is who they are, Sean. You know, so often those of us that are on the right are painted as the racist people, the hateful people. I mean, you discuss this all the time on your program. And I was just asking these people simple questions about if they felt like the president should be impeached or not. These guys come up to me and they say, you know, go back to Fox News to pick cotton. Um, they say, go back to Kenya. Uh, this is who these people are. But I doubt many people in the media are going to condemn these people. Uh, I don't, the thing is, I don't think any of them will. That's the sad thing. You know, we've mm -hmm. become friends now over time, and yeah. I know it, it has happened before. It has happened to Deneen Borelli. I mean, she writes in her book, just Google it. I, I'll, I'll never forget that. Um, and if you're, if, if, if you're black in America and conservative, for whatever reason, there's, to, there's no holds barred. Everything else is, is, oh, we have to watch it. You have to say the politically correct. There's not even an ounce of nicest, kindness. It's open season. Why is that? I, I frankly don't get it. Yeah. Well, see, these guys are upset and, and they're fearful. Notice these were not black people saying this. This was the white liberals saying these type of things because they know that with our reports and exposing the poverty and, and the, the failure of policies that all these Democrat cities have been doing to many people that look like me, uh, they don't want this to be exposed. They believe that all black people need to think it the same way. They want us to stay on the welfare system so we can't progress in life. Uh, um, and I'm going to expose it every single day. If they think that I'm going to stand down because they uh, yelled obscene things to me, um, they got another thing coming. We're going to double down. We're going to go to all these liberal cities. All these presidential candidates are going to have the answer why my community continues to be in poverty. Why is that? Let me ask um, you this, so Lawrence. Yell all they want. 